Israeli troops remain on the border with Gaza, but with their tank guns sealed, while the latest three-day truce moves into its second day. At the same time, Israeli and Palestinian negotiators have resumed indirect talks in Cairo on ending the month-long war. Israeli security and the Gaza blockade are the issues to be resolved. In Gaza, families have been returning to their homes, or what's left of them, after weeks of Israeli airstrikes aimed at destroying Hamas militant tunnels and weapons stores. In Gaza City, dozens of Palestinians queued up to see if their names were on a list to receive 1,000 US dollars as part of a Qatari-backed program to help with reconstruction. Donations raised by the project will also go towards supplying generators and medicines. On Monday, the World Food Programme launched an initiative for emergency food distribution. Israel's offensive claimed the lives of 1,900 people, 75% of them civilians, according to the UN. Israel also suffered 67 losses. The UN has now named a commission to investigate alleged rights violations by both sides.